Hello, welcome to the second uh, video about OneRack. In this uh, video, we're going to be talking about uh, mounting equipment on to uh, the modules. Uh, and this is a, a, a typical module and how we insert that into the unit. Now, uh, you can see this is a really well designed uh, mounting plate. Um, we call it a module and onto it we can mount uh, any size of items up to uh, half RU. Half RU is the, the largest we would uh, normally put onto a module. It would be a 6R module, of course. And onto the module we can put a, a number of devices. Uh, and you can see it's very simple to mount. Um, on this device, for example, there's uh, the, probably the ability to screw uh, onto the uh, module. Uh, and this, the same with these. These are HD1 DX extenders. Uh, but some items don't have that ability, so we could cable tie onto it or Velcro. Uh, your choice, how you want to mount. Um, the nice thing is we can not only mount the devices, but we can also uh, work on our cable layouts as well. So this is a module that I've uh, been working on already. And if you can see on here, I have a HD1 device, a Voyager uh, fiber core, and what I've been doing is I've been mounting the power, and we'll talk about power in the next video into, into these modules. But you can also see how I've uh, routed my cables as well to give me the neatest uh, cable alignment that I can. Now, um, with the HDMI, it's very difficult to lock them in. I know you can get locking cables, uh, but not all suppliers uh, work with those. So what I've done here is I've cable tied down the cables. I've done the same with the fiber here. Now, I know what you're thinking, these cables aren't very long. Normally they'd be longer uh, and we'd have a loop coming out of the rear of the unit. But I've just done this so you can see uh, how it works. Now into this uh, module, uh, this module rather then slides into the rack, into one rack itself. We add dividers, these are the dividers. And uh, you, you can't quite see in the video, but uh, there's uh, li lining up points all the way down here. And these can be any width I want. I'm not limited to a particular width. So you can see I've got different size widths all the way down the rack. And then it's as simple as this. You get your uh, module and you slide it in. Now you'll notice as soon as it uh, slides in, the power will be applied. And like I said, we'll be talking about power in the, the next video. So that's how simple it is to do. Uh, it takes away uh, an awful lot of pain. Uh, it makes it a lot easier to estimate uh, how, how much kit I can get in here. It also makes it a dream for mounting kit. How many times have you been in the back of a rack or in the front of a rack trying to mount equipment? Uh, whereas this, it's really simple. You can do it on the desk and then when you get to the job, slide it in. So that's how we mount uh, into one rack. Stick with us. In the next video, we're going to be talk about uh, how we power our units. So that's mounting one rack. Thanks for watching.